Now, NBC5 First Warning Weather, the area's certified most accurate forecast. All right, 550, here we go. Here is a live look from both sides of the lake this morning, overlooking Plattsburgh and Burlington. Oh, just a stunning start, no matter where you are this morning, Ben. And it's the first day of summer. I'm sure the lakes will be busy today. Temperatures get close to the 80s, especially in the Champlain Valley, but even in the mountains, solidly in the 70s with plenty of sun to enjoy. The summer solstice is today. What does that mean? Well, it's when the northern hemisphere in Earth's orbit is at its greatest tilt towards the sun. So we get the most direct sunlight of the year. And that also means it's the longest day of the year, too. The sun officially came up around 5.08 in the Champlain Valley and it won't go down until 841 this evening. But you can see the change that happens just one month later. The sun rising close to 530, setting close to 830, and then three months from now as we start to think about September transitioning to the fall months, the sunrise gets closer to 630 and sets before 7 p.m. But we're not going to think about that too much on this day. We'll enjoy all of the sunlight and the warmth that we do have with temperatures rising into the 70s and low 80s this afternoon. Plenty of sun, couple of clouds from time to time, but just like the past couple of days, very low chances for rain aside from a spot shower in the mountains. Low 70s in our higher terrain towns today with light and variable winds. It'll be a good day to get outside if you can. The Northeast is nice and quiet. We still have high pressure in control, giving us all the sunshine, but there's unsettled weather down to our south, an area of low pressure with some showers, some clouds, and more humid air. All of this will move to the north as the high moves out, and that's the change we're set up for as we think about the end of this week looking towards the weekend. But outside right now, we're in the 50s and 60s. It's 43 in Saranac Lake, so an extra chill in the air for the Adirondack Park this morning. Plenty of sun, though, through the afternoon. Couple of passing clouds, highs well into the 70s. We'll start off with plenty of sun tomorrow, but look at what happens to the cloud cover. It comes in from south to north throughout the day, and there may be a spot shower thrown in there, too, especially for southern areas. Chance for a shower is much lower to the north tomorrow, but everybody is seeing the clouds as we think about Thursday night going into Friday. Friday will be a mostly cloudy day. A spot shower will be possible as well. And we get the humidity in here. You can see all of the higher dew points off to our south. But as we go through Thursday, the numbers start to come up a little bit. It's not until late Friday and through the upcoming weekend that we have persistent dew points in the 60s and 70s. So thinking it's uh, very muggy and humid through the weekend and beyond with daily chances for showers and thunderstorms to contend with. Back to you.